What is going on everybody? It's Melbro back with Fangs here for episode 10 of the co-op series. Uh, I've just been spending uh, the overnight just upgrading you know, blocks and fighting zombies with a uh, with a shovel. Hey, level up! 22. 40 skill points to spend. Uh, Fangs has been hiding now and it's like he thinks I'm, I've been just humiliating zombies with the uh, with the uh, with the shovel, it's like... Well, can you imagine getting killed by a shovel? How humiliating that would be? Well, you have to think about it. The, the shovel, the shovel head does have a bit of a blade to it, so... Yeah, but you most feel when you whack someone with it, you whack them with the back end, or you hit them with the front, so you're just digging in, so that usually won't kill a person. Yeah, I've seen like uh, I don't know if you've ever seen the uh, uh, the movie uh, Cockneys vs Zombies before. Um, you ever seen that before? Nope. Oh, it's an older movie. It's like a uh, me and my dad absolutely love it. It's a fun. It's a it's a hilarious movie. Like uh, it's one of those British movies, but it's really good. Um, there's actually a scene where like. Where they take a where they take a shovel and they actually, or I think it's a shovel and they actually, like, have a zombie that's like on the ground trying to get back up. They actually take the shovel right to the neck and then they uh, pop his head off. Mm. It's like it it's kind of it's a little gruesome, but it's like it's like you know I would definitely recommend watching uh, Cockneys vs Zombies, especially to those of you if you never seen it. It's a great movie. I love it. It's like uh. I mean, it's up there with Shaun of the Dead, at, which, uh, which I don't know if Fangs has seen that one before. Nope. That's I don't a... watch movies. Shaun of the Dead is a cult classic, uh, but it's like, no, I get it. Not everybody watches movies, but it's like, kind of if you're into zombies, if you haven't seen, like, Shaun of the Dead, it's like, it's one of those, it's like, you gotta watch it at least once. It's, that one's hilarious. I, and I ran out of more. I ran out of wood again. At I have I'll... some schematics for you. Okay, I'll come and get them once I'm done uh, doing the uh, basic skeleton of the building. Yeah, I've just been working on this base overnight, guys. It's literally like, and I'm like, oh, I don't have, I don't have a weapon on me. What a shame. And I'm like, well, what can I use as a weapon? I'm like, I could use a shovel. I just had the sudden realization I could just use my bone shiv. <laughs> wow, I... <laughs> well... You don't I... feel all smart, do you? Like, I... ah, I could have done this. Well, think about it. Actually, think about it this way. I realized, because... Like, I, I remember years ago watching on... Uh, YouTube video, like, uh, from a guy named Gage for Kicks, like, he, uh, this was, like, probably back, w this was back when this, uh, Learn by Doing system was still in play on PC, and he's like, he's like, you know what, I'm just gonna start killing uh, zombies with a shovel, because that way I can level up my mining tools faster. I'm like, I just had that thought, I'm like, yeah, I'm just leveling up my mining tools by killing zombies. <laughs> it works well. <laughs> Ish. <laughs> yeah, I was using a level two. I'm just using this level two forty five shovel that I found randomly in the world. I'm just like a few days ago. I was like, I just got like, yeah, it's like all the weaker zombies. It's four shotting them. I'm like, you know what? <laughs> Let's just start leveling up my mining tools by killing zombies with a shovel. It's viable because. Ah. You might wanna. You wanna know what it's schematics I got for you? What schematics? First, let me check. All right, I'm safe. Uh, I got the leather leg armor, hunting rifle, and I got the eight first aid. But I also, I also gained the shotgun, AK, leather hood, and crossbow schematic. I got. Oh, I nice. got a few. 
What's your weapon levels up to now? Uh, my weapon or gunsmithing? Your weapon levels. Just your weapon. 30. And I'm at... Let's check here. Yeah, I'm at 23. Well, the good news is I'm almost done with the basic skeleton of the base. Dude, do you have the first aid schematic known? Uh, give me one second here. No, I don't. Alright, I have that for you. And just a couple more blocks. Okay, my gunsmithing has leveled up a few times. Basic has... Well, I've at least leveled up my construction tools a little bit just doing that. <laughs> you, can, you can come over now, it's uh, it's basically finished. I'm working on a wall safe. Just making a couple more doors, uh, well, a couple doors for this. It's only the basic level of, uh, of wood, but... I mean, at least not going to be living in a house of frames. Okay, lovely. And I'll just make my bed roll. Uh, okay, at least place the forge down. Place the forge in the middle. And... Opposite of that, we'll put in a... Put in a little... Place for the campfire. Just gotta decorate the home real quick. Make me a campfire. We'll make the... There we go. Got a bed roll going. Campfire's ready. Yeah, very nice. Got most of the... Got most of the stuff, uh, all got most of the house moved to the old house I got a few in. zombies near me. Oh, lovely. I'm just mining open a safe, though. Again. Me and my safes. Do you at least have an iron pickaxe? Nope, stone axe. But it's down to 100 HP. Yeah, guys, uh, I'm gonna get some stuff moved into this little base here and, uh, then uh, tune in with you once uh, I've done so, and, uh, and hopefully, uh, Fangs won't have to spend the rest of his life, uh, beating on a safe. I probably will. Yeah, guys, just finished it. I didn't have too much stuff to put into the, uh, base here. I'm mostly moved in with uh, what uh, what stuff I got. Put the anvil in. Gotta get some iron out of the forge. Did you happen to find a chainsaw, a chainsaw schematic? Nope. Oh, okay. Badly. Because I brought that chainsaw over. Mm. Um... You know, now that I think about it, I'm tempted just to run the shovel as my uh, as my main weapon for melee. What do you think of right, it? Well, eh, that's up to you. No, I meant like, what do, you think? what do you think of the base? Oh. Small. It's, hey, it's, it's basic, but we can expand upon it. Gunsmithing is now level 6. My gunsmithing's up to level 9. Hmm. My weaponsmithing is at 30, with me being able to craft 247.9. Ooh, zombie. Come here, oh, bitch. Uh, uh, I'll unlock the chest in a second, but... Do you mind uh, making some more, uh... Making me a uh, pickaxe and a fire axe? There's like 200... Is your, is your thing that low level? Yes. Mine's only 150, 
So. Mine's only like level 83. Okay, I gotta go grab my stone then. Wait, no, my wood. I was say you can have just to go grab some wood. You have to you have to go grab all the stone from the uh, from the old base. No, it's I have some in the current spot that I'm using as my setup. Ah. How many feathers do you got? Why? I just want to start grinding more weapon smithing. I've only been finding like six or seven from here and there. I but you want a new axe? An axe and a pickaxe. Uh, the four irons in the left chest. Iron fire axe, iron pickaxe. Should I make you know, two of each, one for each of us? Yeah, go ahead. Don't. Uh, it's like a uh, got plenty of stuff. I you really felt like I could just start merging uh, merging iron pickaxes and fire axes together. Then again, probably wait for steel. Yeah. Just gonna start collecting stone. Yeah, me and Fangs were talking about you know, like uh, um, one of the zombies decided to be naughty with Fangs and uh, and show them a private area, and so it's like a they lifted their skirt basically, pretty much. And uh, I was like, yes, yeah, seven days to die, where the zombies uh, want to show you their private areas, and then with the upcoming version. Uh, some will have jiggle physics. Fan service. Just gotta love it. Da -da 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 -da. Just... Really need to keep an eye out for these birds' nests. Oop. Do -do 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 -do. Yeah, it's just what it is. It's like, uh. Things saying, like, you know. Base is a little small, but it's. I like. Hey, we can expand upon it later. We can make it into a massive base. I thought we weren't gonna stay in this area and move to zero zero later. So. I thought we agreed upon staying in here. Oh, uh, it was more of like we were just. I I I was asking if we were gonna eventually set up a permanent base, and you never fully answered. That's why I'm confused. If we're setting up a permanent base, I was. I'm I was. Have to... I was saying that, you know, like, I uh, gotta set up a, you know, that I was setting up shop in, uh, in the northeastern corner of town, so. Ah, a zombie came out of nowhere, couldn't even hear his feet. What was that? I couldn't even hear zombies' footsteps. Oh, yeah. He just came out of nowhere. And it was <laughs> a fatso, too, so I should have been able to hear him. <laughs> hey, good. <laughs> Not all fatsos are heavy-footed. Some of them can be very light-footed. <laughs> That's kind of surprising, though. Considering there's literally a game mechanic for all zombies to have hearable footsteps. Airdrop. Yep. They think that's like our third airdrop of the series. What do you uh, have it set to? Every three days. Then yeah, probably our third. It's in... It is southeast. So just... not too bad. Yeah, not too bad at all. Uh, do, 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 do. Oh, I got facial piercings. When did I find that? Oh yeah, those are basically just good for like one iron. Yep, just delete. Uh, I'll go get the... Supply drop, come closest. Okay, yeah, I'm just working on crafting more, uh, more, uh, stone axes. Figure I'd at least invest into, uh, better tool smithing. Oh, we have a theater here. The Brother Theater. Oh, yeah, that's supposed to be an adult theater. No, it's not. It, the B theater, the boobies, or whatever it is, on like that. That's the, that's the adult one. That's your, uh, that's your, that's the strip club. Like, Ripper, yeah. 
No, the, uh, the, uh, the movie theater from what I understand, like, I've heard people reference to it as, like, an adult movie theater. That doesn't seem m very profitable. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> There are a lot of uh, people that would probably pay to see some stuff like that to, if it's good enough. People are odd. It's, Unlogical. It, it's just human nature. Just human nature at this point. It's It's bound. It's bound to happen. Only 50 more seconds on that pickaxe. I'm just trying to manage all these stone axes that are coming out. I'm trying to make my way over to the supply drop, but I keep finding zombies. Zombies? It's what's for dinner. That'd be quite disgusting. <laughs> now I'm wondering where... Oh, never mind. I like, I'm being where... hunted, but I can't see the zombie anywhere. I like... see their crawler in the grass or not there. I'm like, where's all the, uh, where's all the uh, grill, where's all the grilled meat uh, I made? I'm like, oh wait, that's in my get, get rich or die series. Oh, yes, another floating piece of stone. <laughs> oh, is it like a like a kind of like a bit like a little line, just kind of floating looking thing? Part off of the big rocks that actually spawn, yeah. Yeah, there's actually that's actually like a whole bunch of blocks, like uh, like put into like one little space and it's just glitched out. Our tree is now level seventeen. Yeah, I'm trying to... These uh, zombies just fall over dead. <laughs> They're immediately turning into gore piles. Okay, then. That's a little unusual. That just speaks to how much damage I'm doing. Are you using the blunderbuss? Nope. Ah. Exploding crossbow bolt schematic. And considering I have the crossbow schematic? Wonderful! Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna have some fun! <laughs> Things gonna go boom! <laughs> there's, a, there's a YouTuber I watch, he does a railroading, like, uh, like he's a, like he runs steel locomotives for a museum, and it's like, there's a meme of him just saying, EXPLODE! <laughs> and that just crossed my mind. The zombies are going to have some fun times ahead. You'll make them suffer. You'll suffer. Considering my favorite weapon is the crossbow in this version. And I'm extremely skilled with it. Mm-hmm. Like, I've hit a bug with an explosive bolt before. Dead on. Just boom. While he was flying, so. Ah. Uh. Yeah, I found those, the explosive crossbow bolts have a lot of drop to them. Yep. But it's also the easy to use to find the arrow, or bolt drop. Detected. Ooh, more zombies. They're dead. I'm gonna go kill them. I finally, I finally, uh... Snipe. I finally we got did. done crafting stone axes. How many you craft? Like 80. Which reminds me, I need to get the, uh... I need, yep, there we go. I got a, I made a cooking grill in the forge. That means we can start grilling meat. Yep. And... There we go. Let's see how much grilled meat I can make. 21. Funny how the zombies just collapse with headshots. 
Because some of the head, sh head shots I do ooh, with how they collapse, it doesn't look like they're dead, so I often fire another arrow just to be sure. Oh yeah, I know what you mean. I like, actually had. Are you dead? Are you? Dead? I don't know. Here's another arrow. One of those I've had before in a series, like a uh, where a, a zombie actually killed out. Where I was fighting a zombie, like I think I smacked him once with a club, and then like five seconds later, like he he just killed over and died. I'm just like, what? And it's like I would. I move, run. Yeah, I'm just kind of like, what the. What the hell? Like, you just killed over and died. I don't even... I think I might not have even hit him. I'm like, what the hell, zombie? You really... You, like, you... You you just saw me and you decided to kill over? It was... I was so baffled for that, uh, by that for a second. I was just like, what Our the... Archery is now level 18. I am too good. My wellness is up to 106. Nice. What's your minimum HP? 70. Uh, my minimum's 100. Well, then again, I haven't died nearly as much as you, so... It's like I'm... I'm not usually, you know, like, a starving to death. Uh, I don't think I've ever starved to death on this version. I'm full, but anyways, guys, I'm gonna do some more resource collecting, and uh, anything fun happens, I'll tune in with you. Whether it be me or Fangs dying, or uh, or some funny zombies uh, rolling up. Oh, great! My my inventory is clogged. A zombie. Hello. <laughs> Did you pay your taxes? No. That's why you're dead. Fangs is becoming the. Hit. The Internal Revenue Service. <laughs> the apocalypse. <laughs> oh. Well, someone's got to. <laughs> they missed over a few years of taxes. I think they missed over a decade for the taxes, Fang. Exactly. That's why they're dead now. <laughs> they died due to waiting on their taxes. I Don't think... do tax evasion, kids. <laughs> <laughs> I can just see that becoming a becoming a uh, I like a, a tax commercial now on TV. <laughs> Don't be like these zombies. Uh, they they commit tax of tax evasion <laughs> because they were. Be Don't be like these people because they were dealing with a zombie apocalypse, uh, making and so they couldn't pay their taxes. So. Don't be like these people, kids. Oh, damn. Zombie just died to a balls shot. I shot him right in the nuts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my. I am evil. <laughs> and it's a male zombie, too. It's the fatso. That reminds me of like Call of Duty Infinite Warfare, or like uh, when they uh, like there's a variant for one of the submachine guns where it's like it's called the Boza Zoku, and it and it literally rewards you for for shooting people in the balls. Like it gives you more damage for shooting them in the balls. I I don't know how to feel about that. I don't. I don't want to know how I feel about that either. Rewarding about getting hit down there. Mm. <laughs> Yes, it's the downside though is they take away the headshot damage multiplier, and they they just uh, le they literally just they move remove it. the headshot or no they don't remove it they move it. Yeah, they just move to it down the balls. Yeah, they just move it down to the crotch area. How can the game even tell when you've hit that though? I don't know. Like, it's I such a precision thing. It's even harder than hitting a headshot. Well, I meant. I imagine because like you're shooting, you're shooting low, like because like some people shoot low in Call of Duty, they uh, it'd be easier, be and they probably have it like as a general, um, um, you know, kind of like just a, just a general area, you know. 
But yeah, that that's literally a thing in Call of Duty. It's like, yep, a variant, and like even though it's long, you know, the the time of supply drop weapons is long since gone. It's uh, it's uh, they have a variant that uh, that literally and that literally sh allows you to shoot uh, shoot people in the balls and get a reward for it. <laughs> I feel bad for those zombies, but then again, I did just commit that action, so not really. All right, guys, it's Pat. It's nighttime now, so that's gonna be it for today's episode. Uh, you know, uh, so I hope you all enjoyed watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode, and Fing will join me. Have a great day. <laughs>